So today in this video I have a whole video. Um, I'm still trying to get back into the kind of <sighs> habit of making videos because since I got ill it's just yeah and my like motivation has kind of waned. I've kind of put stuff off and I've kind of thought no, I need to sit down and I need to make these videos and I need to just do it. So, yes, a whole video. Um, I will start off with the most exciting thing. I did make a video on this, like, my last video that I uploaded, and it is this, um, which is a new point and shoot camera. I don't know if I'm keeping it yet, but um, yeah, it's this. It is the Panasonic Lumix TZ80. And yeah, this is the silver version. And I just, I needed an upgraded camera because I don't know, I kind of saw some of the things that this camera did and was like, that's kind of what I need for what I want to take photos of. I mainly take photos of hockey and um, it's really difficult to kind of get a crisp shot. Um, so this has 4K video and in the 4K video you could kind of take a photo and it takes like a burst of photos and then you can pick like any frame from the 4K video that you know you want to take a photo of which I thought was pretty cool so yeah it's also got a touch screen and stuff again it's an expensive camera I'm not sure if I'm keeping it um, this Sunday will be the test of if I'm keeping it or not um, because I have a hockey game this weekend and if it's good, I'll keep it. If it's not good, it's going back. Because it's from QVC and QVC are like the best for, you know, you're sending stuff back. You get 30 days to try stuff out. And yeah, this is a pretty cool looking camera. It's quite heavy. Um, but, you know, if it's good, it's good. It's got 30 times optical zoom on it as well, which I thought was amazing. So yeah, that's that's that. And it also came with this pretty cool case as well, which I really like. So you lift it up like that. I really like that. Um, what else? I got this shirt that I'm wearing. It's kind of like a chiffon material, but it's a Czech shirt. And I've been wanting a, like a Czech shirt that I can wear over stuff for the longest time without it clinging to stuff. And with it being chiffon, it doesn't cling. It's beautiful. Um, it's from Matalan, it's £16 for the plus size one, I think it's £14 for the non plus size one. Um, and yeah, I just love it, I love it to pieces. It's gorgeous, and yeah, I like the fact that it's like a dark check as well. Um, so you can pretty much wear it with anything, so yes, love that. I've recently been like finding some bargains in my local TK Maxx, and today was no different. Um, I got some jeans from... TK Maxx by Triangle by S. Oliver. I don't know, but um, yeah, these jeans are supposed to be from TK Maxx, sixteen ninety nine, but they were, you see, three pounds. And this is the third pair of jeans from my local TK Maxx that I got for three pounds. So for three pairs of jeans, it cost me nine pounds. Wow. <laughs> So yeah, they're just like these kind of faded colour ones. They kind of have like a weird thing on the knee, like, I don't know, can I see? That is like on the knee, I don't know how they're going to hang, but for three pounds, I, I wasn't saying no for three pounds. So I got those. Um, I got these, I got some socks. Um, these are from Sports Direct and these are literally the only socks that I really like. Um, not particularly like the design or anything but the quality of the socks I love and they actually stay up. The socks always roll down on me but these ones they stay up. They're £3.99 for three pairs and these are Minnie Mouse ones and like DC Comics ones so you get like Wonder Woman, Supergirl and yeah all that stuff. So I got those. <coughs> Then I got a bag full of these, literally a bag full of these. These are the um, Nivea Daily Essentials Cleansing Wipes uh, for dry skin. And I got these from Wilco. 
Now I bought some of these before I went to New York and I specifically bought the dry skin ones because I wanted to kind of keep my face nice and refreshed and not dry while I was in New York and these as soon as I like first took my makeup off these were my new favourite makeup wipes and they're so expensive I got them on offer three for five pounds in um, boots they are three pound fifteen for one which I thought was insane so I've been kind of holding off on getting some more I've been using cheap rubbish makeup wipes but these in Wilco are 95 pence and I was like yes they are the 20 packs instead of the 25 packs which but I don't I don't mind I've got like 10 packets of them so yeah it cost me quite a bit but I don't think you get these on offer that often so I just thought I would stock up because I know that these are like my favorite makeup wipes I usually use the simple kind to skin ones but these are just a million times better they make your face feel so moisturized and hydrated and beautiful and it takes your makeup off so quickly so I got those like seriously let me show you the bag this is a bag full of makeup wipes not even lying <laughs> I don't even know if I could show you a bag full of makeup wipes which I'm throwing on the floor I don't even know where I'm gonna keep them but I had to stock up on them because they're lovely anyway <clears throat> Then I went into New Look, New Look recently, not a fan of New Look, I haven't bought anything from New Look in, I can't even remember how long it's been since I've bought any clothing from New Look, I just think that they're so, eh, not on trend and just, I'm not a fan of New Look. I'm not a fan of many places recently because I don't think that many places actually do stuff that's fashionable for plus sizes. Anyway, yes, I bought this which I always like to have a um, perfume in my bag, a cheapish perfume so that in case it like gets damaged or whatever I'm not losing out on like 40 quids worth of perfume or whatever. Um, but I smelt this in New Look and I fell instantly in love because it smells like one of my favourite scents. Let me open it up and show you. Okay so this is the Pure Touch and this is 100ml, it's 12.99. Um, for 100 mil, which I thought was a bargain and it looks like this it's kind of got a green tinge to it and it smells identical to the um, oh, what's it called is it Golden Delicious by DKMY it's identical like I smelled it and was like oh, I've, I own this perfume what is this perfume oh, and it's it's it is that um, but 12.99 for a 100 mil bottle I was like yeah, I'm, I'm buying that. I'm going to have a spray just because I love it. It is, like, literally the best dupe for that that I've ever smelled, and it's just beautiful. Um, so I got that. I also got this necklace, which I got from H&M. It's like a little arrowhead thing. Um, it was 6 99 Really pretty. I like it a lot. Um, I got some new bedding in case you're interested. It's just from Argos. It's um it was 15.99 and it's like flowery print on one side and then on the other side it's like pink polka dots and I just thought it was really nice. I fancied something a little bit more cheery. I don't know. I kind of have at the moment I still have my like Christmas stuff on. In fact I didn't have it on at Christmas. I put it on after Christmas which doesn't make sense but yes it's currently Christmas and I was like I want something new so um, I'm going to probably put this on my bed in a second and I will Instagram a photo. So yes, um, my Instagram in case you're wondering, I will put it here if you want to go and follow me. That would be amazing. And yes, uh, I also <laughs> I also got this, but I'm going to do a video of this on my ice hockey channel. Again, I will put the link somewhere. Um, but I got this, which is just a Sheffield Steelers ice hockey jersey but it is my favourite player Guillaume Debian and it is signed and it is his game worn jersey the last um, home jersey um, regular home jersey that he wore this season and the jersey that he wore the day before they won the league so 
Yes, it's Debian. It's got the little Canadian flags on there, which I really love. And yeah, he's just the sweetest guy in the world and such a good player. And I'm so glad that we've signed him again for next year, next season. So I will do another video of this on my, um, my other ice hockey channel. That's what I was trying to say. So yes, that's my favorite thing of the whole haul, that thing. So yes, I have quite a few videos to catch up on. So I'm gonna go now and I will see you all again very, very soon. Adios.